Welcome to Upgrade. I'm your host, Frank the Tank, and today we're going to bring Murano uh, microphone. It's a microphone, condensed microphone for anything that you guys got out there. Now that you guys are working from home and you want to make sure that they're getting a clear message across from you, and it's very important to have something uh, to clarify on the other end. So now that you're having those Zoom classes, the team meetings, this might be the right microphone for you guys. Now, it's not made for a lot of meetings or anything like that, but you can use it for both, either direct or as a group. So we're going to take a look at it and see what you guys get when you purchase them like this. So let's go take a look. Nice little black box they give you. Uh, they give you all the information, the instructions, and how to connect it step by step. A very colorful instructional book, um, very detailed. Um, how to and everything. And this is compatible with Windows and also Mac, just to guys let you know that it's, it could work either or. So really good, really nice. So we're gonna put it, oh man, look how it's nice and beautiful. And the accessory, let's get rid of the accessory box first. And we're gonna get the mic next. And let's take the microphone out. Really small and tiny compared to the blue Yeti. Um, it's it's a lot lot smaller than it is. So we're gonna put this to the side. This is the actual audio controlling for the mic, so you can mute it from here and stuff like that. So very simple. Very it it gives you a little the detailed little pictures of what you can, what it is for. So easy to understand. Now we're gonna twist it to the back. This is the most important part of the actual microphone. This is where you actually you you actually connect your headset so you don't get that latency so you could hear directly what you're listening to especially your words you want people want to hear how they sound if, it, if it's actually working in the right direction or people talking around you you got to make sure you get the right sound so that's in here now type c connection is included in here and they also include it in the accessory box we're going to take a look at it now on this part it's very simple this is the polar pattern all right this is an omni direction and then, and then we have the if say you're in direct of the mic you're just going to be sitting right in front of it you put it down this direction now this one on the top is actually if you're going to be blogging as a group you can put this in the middle and people can be talking about it so this is perfect for those meetings that you're having and you only have one microphone you just have to just hit this button to the top everybody's included in the mic now this is one direction it's kind of pretty much an umbrella it's half an umbrella so if you can see the little details on the little uh, uh, exactly how the pattern is supposed to be this is very simple explaining uh and of course like i said you plug in your 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 headsets in here now let's take a look at the size of it all right and the size of it is very small from the top to the bottom it's about six inches all right so really small i like it very simple now there's no other controlling pattern but you could you could take this a part here and this screw it fits on a five by eight amount so if you have one of those um extra amounts that they have those they actually have a mount for that they make too also and also like you say if you have the blue yeti with the actual mount too this will fit in there too so not that bad and they do have extensions for for this kind of pattern so you can always buy the extensions and the and the actual converter for a smaller um, input so not bad now tying this up is very simple you just screw it in here and it won't move no more and we're going to take a look at it and see if there's any issues with it but right now as it is we're going to put it back into its own pattern i like this this is kind of like low um kind of like a rubbery kind of simple so it's kind of like for it will get a grip on any kind of surfaces and of course we're going to slip it back in here we're going to tie it up and we'll start using the mic in the box itself they're going to have to give you the extra cable all right and this is probably like a seven footer it's not that long so um if you do want to purchase um, longer cables they do sell them and they have them if you have a type c to c they do have type c to c um now this one's type c to usb so we're gonna go ahead and plug it in and we're gonna start testing out and talking about within the mic right now currently i'm using the blue yeti let me bring the blue yeti all right currently i'm using the blue yeti if you can see it and this is actually the mic if it was backwards it's actually a lot smaller than the blue yeti if you can see it uh direction from here to here the blue yeti is like a half an inch higher actually it's actually even longer because right now i have the let me take this off this is the actual blue yeti if you can see it um so i have this one and it's actually hanging from the upside down on one of my mic stands and the mic is a lot smaller a lot slimmer and we're gonna see if it's a lot better too so let's take a look at it and let's put this on mute all right so we got the mic recording right now it's on full blast on the actual headset but i don't have a headset and i right now currently if you can see it i have it at full blast 
in the actual audio controller. So we're gonna turn it down just a little bit because I see that the gain is a little high in there. And right now I'm in the direction of the mic. I'm about, I will say about two, two, two and a half feet, three, three, um, two feet away from the mic itself. And then I'm gonna move back in direction of, of a little, uh, five feet at least. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I'm gonna move back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so I moved back and just to run the test on it. And the mic seems like it's 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 holding on. So we're gonna set up another thing in the back of it. Right, we're gonna set up the mic in the back. And right now we're gonna put different directional so it could be like surround sound kind of thing to get it. Uh, say you're blogging across from each other and people are gonna share the mic. We're gonna turn this up on the other way. We're gonna turn it around. One, two, three, four, five. And we're gonna turn it to the side. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And then we're gonna one more time. One, two, three, four, five. And then we're gonna bring it back to the front. One, two, three, four, five. So that was the, the directional. It's, it's like a surround sound for every, it's not surround sound, it's like capturing everybody's around you. So this is a great pattern. So we're gonna turn it back to directional one, direction on the, on the polar pattern. And this is directly one, two, three, four, five. And then we're gonna move it to side. It's gonna sound different. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Now, this is without the protective uh, of any any fur ball or anything that we're gonna put in there to protect the mic. We're gonna say, ruffles have ridges. Ruffles have ridges. Ruffles have ridges. Test, test, love, test. So the mic, let's see how it sounds. It sounds pretty good. And, I, and I'm gonna put it really close. Test one two three. 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 It's not that bad. Um, so it sounds. It looks like the gain is. It's keeping up with it. We're gonna take a look at it and see how well it sounds. And um, if you're gaming, you could use this for a lot of things. And it's so small to travel with. It's perfect. I mean, it makes sense if you're gonna be moving around or you're gonna do a podcast. This is a great mic. And optional is. It's, it's like it's really inexpensive. Um, you could buy three or four of these, have yourself a nice little podcast. Everybody's going to have this kind of con uh, connection. You type C USB. The legacy is really, really good. I mean, there's no, there's no, there's no lagging or anything like that. It's catching up. It's keeping up with the actual audio. So not bad little device. And this device is, it's under a hundred dollars and they have optional so you can mount this of course and i'm gonna see if i can put a mount in there you can put the patterns in there so they do like i said um five by eight uh five by eight you could actually mount it and a lot of mounts are made for 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 these kind of mics now these days and it's a really inexpensive condensed mic that you can buy it pretty much on on amazon right now and if you guys like this stuff and you want to game with it it's really good so we're gonna take a look at it and um i'm gonna be gaming with it tonight so if you guys want to see some more hands-on and i'm gonna have this over my over my head pretty much just like the uh, the the blue yeti i have so we're gonna take a look at it and see how well it works but if you guys are looking inexpensive and you like what you guys hear right now it's well worth it so under a hundred dollars really nice mic so if you guys have any questions or any comments let me know i'm your host frank the tank and we're out